I'm a bad person, and you guys know it. <laughs> I was going through my calendar here on iCal, because iCalendar, iCal, is linked to my um, Google Calendar, and my Google Calendar is what I use on every. Um, you know, on my website, I used it on my Blackberry, I'll probably use it on my iPhone, um, you know, that keeps up with every single thing that goes on in my life, and here's like, you know, my month, for this month, um, but, um, I was looking through, because yesterday was my dad's birthday, and right there it is, it's right on the list, it's, it's right there at the top, you guys see it, <laughs> and, uh, let's see, we got my sister's birthday, which I just now added that, because I didn't even know when her birthday was, um, so I added that, and then um, the Apple conference here on the night. But I was going through all of these things, and I'm just like, okay, well, there's my mom, and I've got my uncle and aunts and and grandparents. Well, I don't guess I have all my grandparents. Let's see, March, March. Okay, yeah, there's there's my grandparents, so they're in there, and um, and I'm just like looking. I'm like, well, I know my stepbrother and my stepmom's birthdays are in January, so I go to January, and I'm like, well, there's my grandma or one of my grandmas. Um, yeah, th what? It's not here, <laughs> and I couldn't find it. I'm just like, oh my gosh, surely I've got it somewhere. So I pull out my phone, and I'm like. Okay, well, I go over here, calendar, do, 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 calendar, and I go all the way down here to January, <laughs> and there's no events for January, and I'm just like, how do I not have that? <laughs> I mean, I made YouTube videos showing um, where we went out to eat, and then we had a party, and uh, how do I not have that wrote down on my calendar at all? Um, so I'm kind of looking and I'm like, you know, it looks like I may have gotten the important people. <laughs> Just forgot everybody else. Um, you know, my, my, I got my one sister in here and, um, don't have my other sister or my brother. <laughs> and, um, I've got my dad, but that's only because you have to remember his, you know. You get in trouble, you don't remember his. <laughs> and, uh, you know... <laughs> And I actually have a really funny way of remembering my mom's. And I, I'll just go ahead and tell you guys um, hers because um, she's going to hate me. But I'm going to tell you because um, I have a really easy way of remembering it. Um, hers is October the 13th. And the way I remember this is October is when Halloween comes. And what rhymes with Halloween is something scary. Not rhymes, but, you know, you get the same mindset as, you know, Halloween, something scary. Friday the 13th is scary. Uh, the 13th floor on a motel room, which actually, when we stayed in a hotel, um, it was it went from 1 through 12, and then it went to 14. They actually skipped floor 13. Um which, you know, they didn't, like, have a floor 13 not used. No, they just named 13th floor the 14th floor. Um, so, you know, things that kind of go together. Uh, Halloween, October, scary stuff. Friday the 13th. October 13th. I'm not going to tell you what year. Because um, I don't have a special way of remembering that. And she wouldn't want you knowing how old she is. But, um, oh my gosh. <laughs> so, now I've got to be a retard tomorrow or sometime this week or next week or eventually and ask them, you know, when's your birthday? I know it's in January. That's all I know. Um, there's April. <laughs> I have that one filled out. So, really interesting. Um, I mean, you know, it's kind of hard to keep up with everyone's birthday. Um, but I do have a little feature called MyHeritage.com. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this. It's basically a huge family tree creator. And back when I had a laptop and had a lot of time on my hands, I decided I was going to make a family tree. And I have it branches. I have branches going everywhere. Um, I started with me, and I worked my way out. And I worked with my uncles, and then aunts, and then divorcees, and... Um, you know, current wives, children, children's children, uh, grandparents, grandparents, parents of their parents, parents of their parents. I, mean, I went way back. And, uh, you know, somewhere within this MyHeritage.com, I have those birth dates saved somewhere. I mean, you know, eventually it'll take time for me to just go look it up. I just now thought of that, actually, because, you know. But uh, I do have some of those birthdays saved in there. 
And um, if you guys have ever heard of it, it's a great thing to have. I mean, you know, not only to have your family tree and on a website where your family can access it. Because right now, mine's on the website, uh, myheritage.com, I think, slash Matt Ballou or Matthew Serta. But nobody can access that. You have to be part of my family to access that. Um, which is the, the joy of it. Because, you know, you go there and you get access to denied or whatever you get. Uh, or a login page. I don't really know. And I love that. Um, but, but... On top of all that is I have email alerts set up so a week before an event happens I get an email about it saying hey such and such uh, has a birthday coming up or it's your grandparents anniversary next week you know whatever it knows all that and it sends it to me I've also been getting a lot of emails about possible relations to people who have made family trees that matched mine and I'm really interested in that um, it's myheritage.com and it's free to use um, the the family tree creator is free to use as well. My uncle started using, um, well, I can't for the life of me think of what it is, but he used some kind of family tree creator, and it cost. And uh, he gave me his login to check it out and see what I thought about it. And I really, uh, you know, it was a lot easier to use. It was web-based. There was no actual program you had to download, which, you know, for me being on a Mac now, kind of, that kind of helps. But, um... I tell you guys, I really like my heritage better because it is free and it does seem to have a lot more um, stuff. And not only, you know, like, um, well, I can't log in and show you guys while I'm on video because, you know, of course, that's going to take forever. But um, I've got pictures of each person tagged to their to their name, so their face is tagged to their name, and it, you know, it's it's just really cool. I actually did get an email the other day about my dad's birthday. Um, if I could find that, which I, you know, I probably will never find it right off, but, um, trash of charter. Yeah, I hear you. Be quiet. Let's see. Um, heritage, H-E-R-T. Yeah, here we go. My heritage notification. Calendar alerts. Um, well, this is a really goofy picture. Um, hold on. I'm going to cover up his age because I'm sure he doesn't want that broadcasted. But, um, they got that email, a goofy picture of my dad there. Um, birthday coming up, uh, September the 1st, which was just yesterday. What are you guys doing down there? You're crazy. You're crazy. Um, I noticed in my last video that you guys can see boobies. And that's actually a Grand Theft Auto poster, just so you know. It's not some kind of crazy booby drawing that I have on my wall. So I don't do that. <laughs> um... So yeah, uh, emails and stuff. All right, guys, I'm gonna go. Um, I'm gonna go um, be a Twitter whore, and um, I'll see you guys later.